Hello everyone, welcome back to the Mimic PC tutorial series. In today's video, we're going to explore real-time voice conversion, which allows you to transform your voice into various characters with just a few simple steps. We'll dive into its features like how to upload your voice sample, train your voice to create a model, integrate that trained voice with any target audio, and how to use the vocal remover tool. So first, let's understand how to upload your voice sample. We'll upload a sample audio file which will be cloned and trained with RVC. It is important that the audio has a clear voice, has no background noise, and maintains a natural tone. The recommended duration of the voice sample is 5 to 10 minutes. So to upload your voice sample, click here to access the side navigation bar. You can see all of the folders here. Go to the input folder and click the arrow. Finally, click here to upload an audio file from your computer to use for training. I am choosing a Mr. Beast voice sample as I'm about to change my voice into Mr. Beast's voice. And as you can see, the audio file has been successfully uploaded. Now that we have uploaded our voice sample, we can start training it with RVC. This training process will create a PTH file, which is effectively a model file. So under the training tab, enter the experiment's name. I will not make any further changes because it already has the best settings applied. So just click the process data button. It will start processing the audio sample we uploaded. Once completed, the success message will appear in the output information. Now scroll down. From here, you can choose a pitch extraction. Refer to this table to find a model that suits your needs. The RMVPE pitch is considered to generate the best results. The total training epochs are given below. Epochs ranging from 20 to 30 are recommended for low quality, noisy audio. For high quality audio, the acceptable training epoch is 200. As of now, I'll stick with 50 epochs and I will not make more changes as it already has the best settings applied. So simply press the one-click training button to start the training process. Once completed, the all feature done message will be displayed in the output information. Finally, the PTH file is ready for use. Now we'll combine our trained PTH file with the target audio file, so click here to open the side navigation bar. You can see all of the folders here. Go to the inputs folder. Click the arrow. Upload a target audio file. This could be any recording in which you want to apply the voice transformation. The audio file has been successfully uploaded. Click the Refresh Voice List and Index Path button. In the Inferencing Voice, select the previously generated PTH file. The Transpose key of 12 is used to convert audio from male to female, whereas minus 12 is used to transform audio from female to male. I will set the value to 0 as the conversion voice is male to male. Below, provide the path of your targeted voice file, as we have uploaded the file to the input folder. Thus, this will be our following path. Make sure that you include the audio file's format, as in my case it's .wav. From here, you can once again choose a pitch extraction model. I would recommend selecting the default RMVPE pitch. I will not make any further changes because it already has the best settings applied. So simply click the Convert button to start the integration process. Once completed, the output information will display the success message. The audio that we generated is on the right side. You can even listen to a preview by clicking the Play button. To download it, simply click the button above. Let us hear the before and after results. Mimic PC is a free AI generator website, which offers 20 plus AI apps, including stable diffusion apps with no setup required. Mimic PC is a free AI generator website, which offers 20 plus AI apps, including stable diffusion apps with no setup required. Let's now look at the vocal removal tab in RVC. It gives you the ability to remove vocals from any audio file. If you want to separate vocals and instruments from a song, this feature is perfect. So navigate to the vocal separation tab and scroll down. Simply upload an audio file by clicking here. You can also import multiple audio files. Once it is uploaded, choose a model that meets your needs. I'm going with HP3 All Vocals. You can even change the output folder. I will keep the default opt folder. From here you can choose the format of your exported audio files. I will select MP3. Finally click the convert button. Because it is a vocal removal, the generation process will take time. Therefore, let's skip the generation process. See the success message has been displayed in the output information. So navigate to the opt folder. As you can see, there are two files here, the vocals and instrumental files. To download them, click here. Let's hear a side-by-side -side comparison. No, I don't wanna waste what's left. And we'll go through the 
wastelands through the highways. As you heard, it has done a fantastic job. That wraps our tutorial for today. We explored the power of RVC, learning how to upload a voice sample, train it to create a PTH file, combine it with the target audio, and even eliminate vocals for more flexibility in your creativity. With RVC, you can now modify your audio in exciting ways and explore a world of custom sound possibilities. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more Mimic PC tutorials.